What's up, nerdlings? What up, nerdlings? Do you nerd for a little bit of... Mail and mail. Says it right there on the box. Mail and mail. Mail and mail. Mail and mail. Mail and mail. That's right, nerdlings. We got some more mail and mail. We got a box from Kyle the Collector. He's been very excited to send this to us. He kept talking about it, but he was not dropping any hints whatsoever. Any guesses of what's in there? It rattles. It must be a bunch of rocks. I got a rock. Now, of course, links in the description below to take you over to Kyle, the collector's channel. Kyle's right here in Missouri with us, just a few hours away. Now, Kyle has some pretty cool stuff in his collection. <laughs> One thing that I would love to add to my collection, but I would equally have nightmares from it, is that Legend of Zelda mask. Yeah. It's like, I, I want it, but I don't. <laughs> that thing's terrifying. Now you look like a leprechaun. Well, there you go. There's the bubble wrap you have. That means the rest is for me. Ow. What's in there? What's in there? Oh my goodness. Dear King and Queen of Nerdum, the Regal Tom and Royal Lady Lacey, thank you for <laughs> being a friend. Travel down a road and back again. Your heart is true. You're a pal and a confidant. And if you threw a party, invited everyone you knew, well, you would see the biggest gift would be for me. And the card attached would say, thank you for being a friend. <laughs> I hope these gifts serve as thank you for all that you do for the Missouri nerd culture. Thanks for the video, for the collaboration. And thanks for being so positive, even though this crazy past year, oh, a little bit. I hope to meet again at a RenFest or a convention in the near future. Yeah, your loyal subject and fellow nerdling, Kyle the Collector. Tell you what, Kyle, you look right at home there with the Golden Girls. <laughs> oh. You know, he could be the crazy next door he, neighbor. He does, especially right there. He looks like he's <laughs> the wacky neighbor. That... Just uh, watch out for... Blanche. Should have worn a condom. We've got all kinds of stuff. There's a couple of things in the box right here. That must have been what was rattling. Good, it's not rocks. It's Nintendo Power Mints. Yeah. Get the power. Nintendo Power. And then eat them. <laughs> and... Oh my gosh. Oh, how Look cute. Look at the perler. That goes perfect with my new plushie I got. But that is pretty great. Yes, that is. Do you, do you make this one yourself, Kyle? That, this is awesome. That is pretty great, and that is perfect for the new plushie that I got. Loved Mario in the boot, by the way. He needed more stages. All right, let's dig into this bag full of goodies now. <laughs> Power card number seven, The Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past. They used to put these in Nintendo Power issues. Although this one, the edges look really clean. The ones that they would put in the magazine. They were the perforated ones. Yes, they? yeah. So even if you uh, were real careful trying to take them out, they'd still have that jagged edge. He ain't got no pants. <laughs> That's Link for you. <laughs> a Link to the Past, more like a look at his undershield. Yay! We have been looking at this sleeve for a little while. Look at that sleeve. From Molan. Mm -hmm. So Kyle was working with video game dust sleeves to make an awesome yeah, custom sleeve. That looks great. Showcasing some of the great YouTube channels based here in Missouri. So we happen to be on there, but mm -hmm. with some really awesome channels like Kyle the Collector, you've got 
Hey Dad, let's play. Show me Retro, Batfan87, and Retro Mikey. Plus Retro Tony, and I know for a fact he's been out there wheeling and dealing some of those games. He's always bringing the A game. Now you're playing with Mo Power. That slogan is great. That this is sleeve great. is great. Yeah, that is a great sleeve. So, where it says from Mo Land, what does that make you think of? Funko Land. Yes, I love the logo. But that's not the only sleeve. Woohoo! Oh, we got Kyle the Collector merch. Nice. Well, you will have to tell us what game you want in your sleeve. Ooh, too true. We got the business card. Nice. Look at his stickers. Those are great. Yes. Those are Some really nice great. vinyl stickers here. I like the the Kai OK I know, that's in the good. N64 yeah, look. That's pretty great. There's a robot. His <laughs> name is Bob. Uh oh. I don't feel so good. What happened? Ha, 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 ha. Oh no, I have gone Atari 2. Oh, nice keychain. Oh, that is great. Now there is a card for Sticker Mule. Now that's who We've, we get yeah. our stickers from. We've been looking into doing some of the... Yeah. And now seeing them in person, it's like, okay, we're definitely next I time. I think I'm sold. Yeah, I'm definitely sold on these. These are great. That looks really, yeah. really good. Oh my gosh, the Kyle stuff keeps coming. Oh my goodness. Well, great, now you gotta pick out two games. Sweet. The ever classic, full on custom video game desk sleeve. Nice. Kyle the Collector sleeve, and. Oh, he signed it. He's That's thinking awesome. ahead. Thank you very much. Normally, we have to wait until we've made it to a convention mm -hmm. to get people to sign their sleeves, so. Thank you. That is pretty great. And like Lady Lacey said, you're going to have to let us know. Two games. What games are going in these. Ooh, now that's snazzy. I, I like is. that. That is going to go perfect on our luggage. We each have a controller so we can both play. We can play. Yay. Beep, 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 beep. Mm -hmm. And I actually just bought a new suitcase, so this will be perfect. Yeah, well, hey, having two, that means that we can actually use one, but keep one. Exactly. <laughs> so exactly. In case someone tries to run off a little bit. Oh, no. Maybe we need to put one of these on the barrel so that Captain Algebra can't steal our barrel. Oh, good thinking. <laughs> All right, we've got a case here with... Oh, I know what this is. It's a tiny. Do you know what it is? Is it for a Switch game? It is. So you put the Switch game right in there, and then the artwork that is on the Switch cartridge that is so cute. shows up as like the label for your little that is mini so NES. That's so neat. I've been seeing these making the rounds. Because they don't look so, 3D printed. So cool. That's what's so neat about them. They don't look 3D printed at all. That is awesome. That's so cute. Now we'll have to either decide what game gets to go in there or if you want to start collecting these because you love, I love miniature miniatures. stuff I do anyway. Love miniatures. <laughs> so first of all, a little check bit of out sleeve. Yes. Nice. I feel like I saw these in some of like the collector's editions mm -hmm. and I thought that was really cool. I thought it was real clever that they did that. But I didn't know if they sold any of them separate because if they did they might, if I they, might have missed out. If they on don't it. sell them separate, it might be something like at a convention. Like if you come across them at a convention. That's true. Actually, would make for perfect convention um, giveaway. Yeah, it really would. And he even sent us a Famicom game. Getting classic Ooh, it's with orange. Mario Brothers. Yeah, she just likes the colored like Famicom the cartridges. The original I Mario like Brothers. So this one we can get in there. We can knock down some bees. We can hit some Koopas and watch out for crabs and hit some pow blocks. You know what song needs to be parody? ABBA's um, Trooper song needs to be Koopa Troopa. <laughs> I don't remember the rest of the words enough to come up with something else. Someone might already have. We need to look that up. Koopa Troopa, shells are gonna grind me, but I will not rage. 
I will beat the stage Even if it takes all day <gasps> Oh my gosh! <laughs> is that baby Yoda or is that just a little Yoda? That, that is, is so tiny. Oh my gosh. That's so little. It's so small. It's so tiny. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. That how you lose him. He's so cute. You just gotta peg him to a board now. <laughs> no, Yoda, don't blow up my brain. <laughs> He's so mischievous. Well, this one, I'm guessing this must be for you. Un unless he was wanting me to try that on. I don't Check know. it out. Hey, that looks kind of familiar. <laughs> a little familiar. <laughs> nice. So now you've got a platinum. I do. And, and a, gold. a golden one. Very nice. Very pretty. I like how they made the um, heart piece on the inside diamond cut. So yeah. it kind of really gives that nice sparkle to it. That is gorgeous. That is I, very pretty. I really have always liked the way the heart piece looks. Mm -hmm. I believe from Twilight Princess because it's all emblazoned like that. Mm -hmm. Oh, cool. Look at the Triforce. Oh, wow. That's really pretty. I like that. You Neat. said some awesome yeah. stuff, man. Thank that you. That is some really cute stuff. That's so cute. Do you have a favorite? Oh my goodness. I don't know where to start because first of all... I know, it's all, that there's so many different things. So. I, I'm a sucker for the custom sleeves. Yeah. So I love that. I love the Kyle the Collector merch because the stickers are fun. The keychain totally sold me on yes, giving us some keychains now. We love to use Sticker Mule. I love how well the From Moland sleeve came together. That really, really looks sharp. Of course, Mario Brothers love adding some more Famicom games to the collection. Anything Zelda. I absolutely love. This is super cute. That is cool. I'm glad to finally see one yeah. of these in person. Without seeing it in person, I was like, I don't know if I'm sold on them yet. Well, and like I said, it doesn't even look 3D printed. Oh my gosh, yeah. I don't even know. Actually, no. I do know what my favorite thing is. It's the thing that might have to get framed. We might just have to. <laughs> what I need to do is put this in a frame and just like put it up at work. <laughs> Well, oh my gosh. What an awesome surprise, Kyle. This is Thank a you. Good mail Thank you box. Thank you so much. Some really great stuff in here. And you said it best. Cannot wait to get back to a convention, get to hang out with you some more, <laughs> maybe meet up at a Ren Fest with you sometime. Uh, that'd be a lot of fun. They she's, need to have those this year. She's been missing a Ren I'm Fest. I'm chomping anyway. at the bit, man. <laughs> <laughs> so, Nerdleads, please let us know what you think of everything here and let us know what you think of Kyle the Collector if you've been watching him. If you haven't, one more time, link, description below, go check him out. And go thank him for yes, being a please. friend. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> uh, Give the video a like, <laughs> leave those comments down below, subscribe, notification bell, all that jazz. And don't forget to like us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Go over to Public because we have merchandise over there. Hit us up on the Retro Refresh. And if we like it, we nerd it. Just don't blow on cartridges. What did you just say? <laughs> you said don't blow on it. And again, Kyle said it best. Thank you for being a friend. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, nerdlings. Bye, nerdlings. Scratchy, scratchy. <laughs> You're going to use it as we roll, aren't you? I mean, outtakes. <laughs> Ready? Thank you for being a. Let me, let me practice my my queen wave. Oh! It's a bag in a bag. And I can't get it open. Help, computer! <laughs> Stop all the downloading. So I love how the how well the fro man. <laughs>